Hi. Today I want to talk about Galloway v. Moran Towing of Lake Charles, which is a federal court case out of Lafayette, Louisiana. This case is important because it illustrates how long seamen are entitled to receive maintenance and cure benefits from their vessel employers. Galloway injured his back on Moran's towing vessel, the Eleanor Moran. To treat a spinal injury, Galloway's doctor recommended surgical insertion of a spinal cord stimulator which allows the patient to send electrical impulses by remote control to relieve the pain. Maintenance and cure benefits are owed to the point of what's called maximum medical improvement, or MMI, which is the point at which further treatment will result in no betterment of the seaman's condition. Therefore, when it appears that the seaman's condition is incurable, or that future treatment will only relieve pain but not improve the seaman's condition, MMI is achieved. Moran asked the court to find that it no longer owed maintenance and cure benefits to Galloway since it contended the spinal cord stimulator only relieves pain and does nothing to improve his condition. Based on Galloway's doctor's testimony to the contrary, the court denied Moran's motion seeking to terminate maintenance and cure benefits. The important takeaway for Seaman is that your employers will always try to find a way to terminate maintenance and cure benefits as soon as they can. It's important to hire an experienced maritime attorney to oppose this practice. If you have any questions about your maintenance and cure benefits, please contact me on my website at www.salta.law. Thank you.